just got back from Finland last year. Uh, amazing experience. And um, so we now have um, um, hundreds of other events coming up. We, we have a site that we go to and we can just see all of these events that we have coming forth and not only in Canada, but internationally as well. So uh, I just got back from the North American Invitational in Regina, as I mentioned, and we have our BC Cup coming up next month. So for us, where, is that? where will that be? That'll be hosted here in Prince George at, uh, at Dutchess Park. So, wow. Yeah. And for us, the, the, the BC Cup, we like to host uh, the BC Cup. We have, we have a provincial and we also have the BC Cup. Yeah. The BC Cup allows me to invite uh, other provinces and even schools from the United States if they choose to come up here. So uh, that's the one that we like to host because we can get more people to come to yeah. it, obviously. Yeah. Uh, Prince George is difficult for people from the lower mainland to want yeah. to come up here for some reason. Um, you know, even though we are centrally located, uh, it's it's a challenge to unfortunately to get lower mainland uh, clubs to come up here, especially since our tournament seasons are usually spring and fall. Right. So just road conditions summer, are not are not right? the the most ideal for travel. So yeah. Uh, however, uh, again, we are hosting the the BC Cup, and absolutely looking forward to this. We haven't had a tournament here in Prince George uh, since 2018. Amazing. So we're, we're definitely looking forward to hosting this again. We expect to have 250 to 300 competitors. Wow. Uh, ranging from, again, I mentioned the pre-juniors or pre-preschoolers. So our four and five-year-olds all the way up to our, our senior black belt division. So wow. full day of competition, but it's, it's busy and hectic right from the opening ceremonies right to the, to the closing round.